Police are looking for two men, two women who attacked a laundromat worker in Brooklyn, and it was caught on camera. CBS 2's Jenna DeAngelis has more on what led to the violence. Surveillance cameras capture these two women assaulting an aqua wash laundromat employee. One threw a vase at the 69 year old man, another hurled a blanket at him. She then appeared to drop a knife, turned back to pick it up, and ran off. It looks like the worker on the ground was also holding a knife. Yeah. Shock. That total hurt. Total dismay. Tracy Lynch is a regular at the 24 hour laundromat on East 98th Street, but wasn't here on June 8th when this happened, still wondering why it did. Like, what did they champion from assaulting this person? That is a good fellow. He works here in the evening, he's helpful. Sources say around 4 a.m., the women entered the laundromat to use the ATM unmasked. There are signs on the door here which state you must wear a mask while inside the laundromat. A worker here told us that's what the victim asked the women to do, which led to a dispute. And it's sad that people just can't follow instructions. They have to hurt each other. This woman, who didn't want to show her face on camera, says she wears one because she's immunocompromised. You should respect people's uh, premises. If you come in to their uh, environment and they ask you to wear the mask, you should do it. No matter what the reason, Lynch says there's no excuse for this behavior. When I see something like that in my community, it almost it hurts me in the inside. I cry because it happens too long. It's not like this is something that just randomly happened. And so we treat ourselves better. How can we ask someone else to treat us better? So I pray that they surrender and admit what they did that was wrong. In the meantime, police are searching for the women, asking anyone with information to call. In Brownsville, Brooklyn, Jenna DeAngelis, CBS 2 News.